Hello, this is Ken Klein. I'm back with you again to pick up where I left off when I mentioned alpha and omega vision. Now, if you remember, I said probably that title isn't going to grab you that much, but the reason it's so important is because it's mentioned, at least the term alpha and omega is mentioned in the first chapter of the book of Revelation where Jesus says, I'm the alpha and the omega, the beginning alpha, and the omega, the end. Now, what, what did he mean by that? What's the importance of that? And how should we integrate it into our understanding? He's speaking about the fact that he is from the beginning of time to the end of time. Now, most of us don't think about time other than our own lifespan. We don't think about history. We don't think about the future. We're not that interested. We live here on this small little planet and we're consumed with ourselves and our own lives. But God wants to impart to us something of greater significance than our own lifespan, and that is the Alpha and the Omega. He wants us to have a kind of vision that sees far off. And our mission on this planet, my mission, is to help you see far off. It's to give you a different lens, a different kind of way of looking at reality instead of the temporary, instead of looking at the minuscule, to see the macro, to see the big vision, to see the forest from the trees. Most people live in a valley in their understanding. They don't see from the mountaintop. Alpha Omega vision is about seeing from an objective understanding of existence. And until we get that kind of vision, we, we just don't think too deeply. So our mission and what we've put together at Ken Klein University is a kind of a spiritual lens that helps you see things from afar off, from a mountaintop. I live at a place where I look out at a valley below. We're at about a thousand feet up on a mountain. And I'm constantly reminded that I can see from one end of the valley all the way to the other end of the valley. I can see in, in a physical sense the alpha and the omega from my position. I can see to the right all the way to the left, almost 180 degrees vision in the physical dimension, at least <clears throat> in my temporary home here. But I want to share with you things that will give you a more comprehensive, comprehensive understanding of existence. All of our messages at Ken Klein University deal with things that are expansive, far off, far away eyes. Most people have nearsighted vision instead of farsighted vision. And so what I want to give to you, what I want to equip you with is a new lens, a new way to see reality. One of the things the Pharisees uh, were guilty of that, that Jesus accused them of was that they strain at a gnat, something small, but they swallow a camel. They miss the big picture. And so what we're involved with at Ken Klein University is giving you the big picture all the way back to the to the beginning, all the way to the end of time, we want to help you see uh, 360 degrees instead of your maybe five degrees. So when you come to Ken Klein University, you're going to be exposed to teachings such as where did, uh, for example, uh, Islam come from? Uh, how is the United States figure into biblical prophecy? Um, how did the universe get started? Where did it come from? How does it unfold and how does it retreat? Uh, these are the kinds of messages that you're going to experience when you come to Ken Klein University. We will be equipping you with the Alpha and the Omega vision.